Klitschewskaya volcano has exploded. The top of the volcano has created a huge ash cloud from the previous eruptions, uh, solidified lava, and a mixture of the new lava also. This is amazing. The height of the ash cloud has risen now to 13 kilometers. That is exactly at the boundary of the stratosphere, top of the troposphere, as you can see. It's blocking the sun gradually. If it reaches the stratosphere, it will be able to freely travel around the world. At the moment, what we can see is that this ash cloud is reaching the boundary. There is a temperature in inversion at that uh, place uh, where the actual stratosphere is slightly hotter than the troposphere, the top of the troposphere. As you can see, the rising of the ash, we are witnessing this historic moment. The geologists at the Institute of the uh, uh, um, Geophysics in the Kamchatka were able actually to predict this uh, eruption several uh, days before, almost a week before, and announced it to the authorities. So the alarm was raised from uh, normal green to yellow and then red. And this happened just after the red. And you can see that the ash cloud is rising. This will develop into a new situation when it reaches the stratosphere. It will be class 2 even, or class 1. This is the troposphere, as you can see. The thin layer of the atmosphere from the Earth to the stratosphere. If it reaches that stratosphere, it can freely move around the world. This is amazing that the scientists were able to predict this uh, eruption in time. And more amazing is that uh, we are able to see what's happening there. It's the most remote area in the Russia almost.